Okay, and the last operation we have is to drill those eight holes. To do that, I'm going to show you another way to copy and reuse information. There are many different ways to reuse information within Top Solid 7. If I go to my operations manager over here, here I see my centering pointing operation that we just created. I can right click on this and I can choose copy. Then I can right click on this and I can choose paste. I can also use the control C, control V windows commands. With the copy and pasted, all I'm going to do is edit the copied one. And now I'm going to switch from centering to drilling. I'm going to go to my tool selection, double click on twist drill, and I'm going to create a twist drill of a quarter of an inch. Again, speeds and feeds, set them as you need. 50 sounds good to me. If I go into my settings because I'm in a drilling now, maybe about the only other thing that we're concerned with is using a picking, or pardon me, a pecking or clearing routine. Here's your pecking, your chip break cycle, this is a clearing cycle. Choose it, fill in the settings below, and away you go. So for example, I want an eighth inch pecking increment. Perfect. Green check mark, and I'm done. If I want to simulate this, I can always go back to the tool path and either right mouse button click on it and choose simulate, or left mouse button click to the left of the eyeballs here. Here comes the toolpath, and if I slow this down a little bit, I'm using my minus key on my keyboard, by the way, you can see it's even simulating the pecking cycle. Kind of cool. And again, like that, toolpath was done quickly and efficiently, thanks to Top Solid Camp.